गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स आम आरती आई एम गोइंग टू डिक्टेट यू एक्सरसाइज नंबर थर्टी एट फ्रॉम सेवन हंड्रेड कॉमन वर्ड्स बुक प्लीज लाइक द वीडियो सब्सक्राइब द चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन फाइव सेकेंड स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द शिप द मैन वॉज लुकिंग एट द लैंड इन द डिस्टेंस He had been on the high seas for nearly three months, and the ship had touched land several times. Those land falls had meant little to him, however, because the only country he now had any desire to see was the country. ahead to him at present it was hardly more than a point showing above the water that country was home his homeland that he had left 6 years before his mind went quickly over those 6 years of his life he was a young man of 24 when he had gone away at 30 he believed himself to be quite old and he certainly looked more than his 30 years on the other hand he looked the picture of health 6 years of trying to make money in mines and on farms in the far off countries of the world had made him hard and strong whether now had no personal meaning for him to be warm or to be cold was all the same so far as his personal feelings went whether interested him only through its influence on his work whether he was in the mines in the building trade or on a farm whether influenced production and was therefore important but it did not influence him his face was quite heavily lined for his years the result of some of the hard times he had experienced before finally making the big money that he was looking for he knew what it was to be in the open through long cold nights and also what it was like to walk for mile after mile in the burning heat he knew what it was like to go without food for several days at a time and he had experienced hours when he would have given his whole future life for a simple drink of water he knew the value of water all right and he had made up his mind that however long he might live in the homeland he would never touch a hard drink water had brought him back to life when he was almost dying for want of it he would always remember the experience of opening his eyes to see a man beside him and to feel the touch of water at last the man had had a horse and together they had reached the next town week thou he was from that day on he had never drunk anything but water or milk and he cold himself as he continued 
to look at the point of land standing up out of the water he would not change his mind when he reached there safely not one penny of the hundreds of thousands of pounds that he knew had in the bank would be spent on hard drink either for himself or for his friends in his early days he had several times nearly drunk himself out of this world and into the next the money he had labored so hard to get in the mines or on the farms had been spent overnight with not a penny left to sow for it but things had changed after he reached that town with the man on horseback who had saved his life they had become friends and life had taken on a new color the man was looking for gold he knew where to find it he said but it was necessary for the two men to work together one man on his own could not take advantage of the opportunities to his great surprise his friend was speaking the truth they found the gold and before a year had passed they both had all the money that anyone could desire then the man on the ship remembered something more he had left a girl behind her eyes were so wide open and blue when she looked at him and said that she would wait that he had complete trust in her words now he could not help feeling doubtful would a girl wait for a man if she heard nothing from him for 6 years common sense said no but his heart said yes stop